pray, Heavenly Father, that you would just uh, continue to guide them, that you would be the center and the focus of their marriage throughout their whole life, that uh, they would always look to you for guidance before they look anywhere else. We love you today, and we love them. And we just pray and ask these things in Jesus' name. Amen. In Ephesians it says, Husbands, love your wives just as Christ loved the church and gave himself for her. I pray that I always seek to be a man after God's own heart, first to honor and pursue God, second to honor and pursue you. I will strive to always push you towards Jesus because I was never meant to fill that Jesus size hole in your heart. I thank God every day for you and I can't wait to start a life together. Even though we had just met, you held the light for me all the way to the car from Sunset Rock. We just said maybe two words to each other at that point, and you showed me the kindness, which is exactly what I had been praying for in my future husband. And the most important, someone who always puts Jesus first. You are one of a kind, and today is our day, and I can't wait to have your last name. We ask that this ceremony would not be just a simple celebration, but a moment in time that reflects your great love your sacrifice made and offered in the gospel, we would ask that your name be made great here and that we would walk in gratitude for all of your good gifts. And we ask this in Jesus' in precious holy name. Okay. Emily, as you have been freely and joyfully made your covenant with one another and before God, for your friends, for your family, going forward in the strength of the Lord, what God has joined together, let no man put us under. Dave, let me kiss you, bro. <laughs> okay. I would like to present to you for the first time, Mr. and Mrs. David.